All right, we continue up here at Erskine College on the Palmetto Pigskin Tour. We had the Coach Shep Boyd with us uh, just a moment ago. Now we're joined by the quarterback, Craig Pender, out of Barnwell. He's a, a war horse, uh, deep roots in the yes, war horses, a lot of penders coming out of Barnwell. Yes, sir. And Josh Komodo from Woodmont High yes, School. Sir. Yes, sir. Where he was a, uh, what did you say, you were a Wildcat? Yes, sir. Wildcats. Okay, yes, very yes, good. Sir. It's great to have you guys with us. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Really Glad appreciate it. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Craig, what about the offense? You heard what Coach had to say. First of all, I mean, he loves this team. He thinks you guys have really stepped it up. Yes, sir. I agree. Um, this is a uh, – I'd have to say I've been here for a while. Um, I got here in 2020. But um, this offense is uh, – it's grown a lot, especially in the past year. Um, a big culture change, a mentality change. Um, just really, you know, um, we want to score a lot of points, and that's what we're trying to do. And um, – you know, we got we got some guys who have been here for a while uh, right here. But then, like, especially uh, in our playmaking room, uh, running back, receiver, our H-backs, uh, we're, I mean, we're young, but we're explosive. They're guys that can really make plays, um, and I'm excited. I'm excited for really the whole offense, but really what we can do um, in the perimeter. And also, we're going to, like Coach said, we're going to be able to run the football. Yeah. So, um, I'm excited for that as well. Big O.L.? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Strong guys O.L.? Move. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. Josh, you face that offense in, in practice. What do yeah. you see? Man, I see a lot of growth from the uh, last couple of years I've been here. They, uh, I don't want to say it, but they be putting it on us a little <laughs> bit sometimes in practice. But, hey, <laughs> we got to give it up. I think uh, Coach likes that. I mean, of course, <laughs> yeah, he co- yeah. doesn't he coach the defense? Yes, sir, he does. <laughs> but, hey, like uh, you got to – I want to see that, though. I want to see them be able to you know, work down the field. Uh, whatever you can do in practice, you can do in games. So as long as they can move the ball in practice, and they'll be able to do it in games. So I'm excited to see what they're going to do out there. All right, tell me about the side. defense and how it's looked. Man, the defense. I mean, even though you're telling me you're getting whipped every day in practice, <laughs> but otherwise, generally speaking, how's the defense look? Oh, <laughs> uh, the defense, we're young, but we're excited. You know, we're ready to get out there, you know, play nasty um, in between the whistles. We're just ready to uh, fly around. Uh, coach simplifies the defense so we don't have to think so much. We can just go uh, make a play. So that's why I'm, I'm excited about this young group. Um, I think we're ready. I think we have a lot of uh, – still some more growing to do, but you can, you can do that in the, in the game. So I'm, I'm excited about this group. Um, a lot of younger guys, but I think we'll be okay. Craig, um, going through last season, um, and now it's a brand-new season, but, you know, um, you guys had to be tested in a lot of ways last season. So yes, what did you, as a leader of this team, what do you sense from the guys – coming off of last season, how maybe that's going to motivate you and help you this year. Right. Um, when um, Coach Anton um, became the OC, he uh, he's big on, uh, like, acronyms. And he did our ABCs, and this is on our, in our offense. It's accept, believe, and commit. Um, and there's a lot of guys accepting, believing, and committing to what this offense is going to do this year. And, um, I mean, I, I, as the leader of the offense, need to – you know, be in the forefront of that and show people that I accept, believe, and commit. And I believe that we have a lot of guys on our offense that are doing all three of these things. And we're attacking it. We attacked it in the spring. Um, we showed it in the spring game. I felt like we played really well. And we, I feel like we have just built on that. And we've made it um, where um, going into week one, we are excited, really, really excited. And then going on after week one, of course, but, you know, one week at a time and our mentality is on St. Andrews on August 31st. Sure. But, um, I'm really excited for the – like I said earlier, our mentality on offense is so much different um, even in a year. And I've been here for, you know, a while. But uh, this mentality of this offense is just um, kind of a culture shock, culture change, which is a good thing. Josh, uh, we joke with Coach, you're passing through a new league. But, yes, boy, sir. they threw you into the fire <laughs> yes, sir, in this did. new league. I mean, as we talked about the schedule, you do have five home games That's to open up. but. Are you guys ready, uh, you think, physically and mentally to kind of step up into maybe one of the best, if not the best, D2 leagues in the country? Yes, sir, I think we are. I think I'm a big believer in uh, playing up to your competition. You know how they say you can play down to your competition. I believe you can play up to your competition uh, too as well. So I think this team, we're going to have to play up to our competition if we want to complete compete in this league. So I think us having this schedule, I think is I think is a good thing for the school and a good thing for the football program. So we can put out there what we can do, and um, I'm excited. 
I'm ready. Never, I never back down away from fear. How important is it to go out against St. Andrews in that opener and make a statement? It's very important. That first game is going to be very important. Um, you work on the summer, work all summer, work out. Then you come fall camp, work out. So this first game is big. It's a big uh, uh, game, motivation for the boys. So I think this first game against St. Andrews is going to be big for us. I agree. Got about 15 seconds, Craig. You want to add to that about how important it is to get off on the right foot? Uh, yeah, um, I feel like it could set the tone for the whole season. Uh, I really do. So I'm excited for what we got going on, and I'm excited um, for another year with the fleet. Yes, sir. Like what we hear. It sounds great. Yes, sir. Fans have got to be excited about it, too. So yes, sir. you got Should five be. home games to prove it to people. So yes, sir. good yes, luck sir. to you. Appreciate you guys coming of over. Course. Thank, Thank you for you. having us. Craig yes, Pender and Josh Komodo visiting with us here at Erskine College, and we'll be back in a moment. 